Hello guys, I am back for another video. Before I start my video across Canada, States, Europe, Asia, Africa, and also Australia, subscribe if you need to subscribe. Push the bell, push all to watch my videos. Give it a like, nice comment, and let's start. This is the top 10 hardest WWF Divas. Number one is Deborah. Number two is Jacqueline. Number three is Terry Reynolds. Number four is Miss Elizabeth. Rest in peace to Miss Elizabeth. Number five is Sunny. Number six is China. Rest in peace, China. And guys, you don't know this, but about China, the wrestler Diva, well, you know, the wrestler Diva, China, she actually was an actress in the 90s. She actressed a show called Third Walk from the Sun. It was, a, it was an epic sitcom in the 90s with Dick and Harry, Sally, and that that kid, I can't remember his name. And number seven is Ivory. Number eight is Sable. Number nine, Tori, uh, is Tori Wilson. And number 10 is Jazz. Okay, so for the, let's turn the page. So Deborah was a good Divas wrestler in, in, in the 90s. Also the manager of Stone Cold Steve Austin. Jacqueline, a great wrestler in the in the 90s. Terry Reynolds, here's a true story. Terry Reynolds was a manager of Gold Dust in the late 90s. 96, 99. Miss Elizabeth, she was the, the manager of Randy Savage. And there's a couple of videos of her pretty when uh, famous. Sunny, also the manager of the Legion of Doom, Hawk and Animal. China, she is a good wrestler and a good actress. Ivory, she was well, there was a, a separate. Pro, uh, separate professional wrestling flagship program. I can't remember what it's called, but it was, it was all women's wrestling. I'm not sure, but I think it was in the 80s, I believe. And then after that, she went to censorship, uh, well, right, to, right to censorship. No, right to censor with uh, Steve Richards, the Godfather, and Paul McCannon. Sable, the other great wrestler. Uh, Tori Wilson, another great wrestler. Jazz, here's a choice story about Jazz. Jazz actually debuted in ECW, ECW, Extreme Championship Wrestling, in the 90s, early mid 90s. And then she debuted in the WWF, Walls of War. And yeah, so that's the history on the Divas, on the old school WWF, the old school WWF in the 90s. So that's it for the video. And across Canada, States, Europe, Asia, Africa, Australia, subscribe, give you subscribe, push the bell, push all, watch my videos, give it a like, nice comment, and Live long and
prosper. Have a good evening, guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow. And bye.